name is Russ Mormon. I'm with uh, Ag Leader Technology. I'm in our marketing department. I've uh, been with Ag Leader for over 20 years now. Uh, Ag Leader is a uh, privately held company out of Ames, Iowa, uh, which makes us a little unique in the industry. We've been uh, uh, making precision ag products for over 25 years now. Agfinity encompasses everything that Ag Leader does that's cloud-based. Uh, everything from our MapView products, uh, display cast, uh, remote support, um, our new prescriptions uh, app that we offer, uh, our iPad app, just everything that we do cloud-based is just kind of covered by the single term Agfinity. So what uh, traditionally we've done is we've had a desktop software platform uh, for many years now where growers and other folks could create prescriptions. Uh, what we were getting lots of requests for was basically, uh, for lack of a better term, an easy button. So now growers, all based uh, in the cloud, they don't even have to have a, a copy of our desktop software, can take their yield maps and actually create uh, prescriptions based on removal, um, all with the click of a couple of buttons. The data comes back, shows up in, in Agfinity, and they can either ex export it to an Ag Leader display or actually we can export it out in a generic uh, prescription format that can be used on almost any display. A big improvement that uh, is in our in-command displays, and the reason display cast is important is a few different things. One, say in a uh, planting scenario, if a grower has two planters in the same field, traditionally a pain point has been one planter doesn't know where the other planter's been, so when we're talking about electric drives or clutches shutting the planter sections on and off, uh, they couldn't share those maps. Now all those maps are shared so that each one knows where the other one's at. Where that also can become important is if a grower has one display for planting and another for spraying and they want to share guidance lines, I don't have to go back to display one. All the guidance lines are shared in the cloud. The sprayer can grab any one of those guidance lines and they can share it. Uh, same thing if you had two planters in the same field, they just share the same guidance line, everything comes out perfect. It just, it's a lot less pain points. You don't have to go and, and manually move data. It just everything is on every display all the time. With Agfinity, your data is everywhere all the time. It's on your uh, mobile phone, it's on your tablet, it's on your computer, uh, it's on your display. It's, it's everywhere, you have easy access to it. And that was the thing, we wanted to make it easy and we wanted to have it anywhere all the time because if you're in the coffee shop talking about stuff, if you're with your insurance guy, you're, you're buying seed and chemical, you have that data with you all the time and it's really simple and straightforward. That's an excellent, that's just something uh, we've brought into Agfinity that has been a, uh, an important tool for a couple of years for us now. What we're able to do with that is if I'm out in the field and I'm having trouble getting something set or I'm noticing something going on, uh, I can grant permission to a trusted advisor or my Ag Leader dealer to actually log on to my display and help me run through button pressing to get stuff set up. I mean, uh, you know, if, if I haven't planted for a year and I jump in and I'm trying to set up my display for the planter and I'm like, oh, I just can't remember where a certain button is. I can allow somebody to log in and it saves, it could save a, a grower a, you know, a, a trip for his dealer to come out on a service call. He can just remote in quick and he, he just has less downtime. One of the things that makes uh, Ag Leader and Agfinity unique from some of the other cloud-based data systems out there is in our user agreement, uh, we, Ag Leader takes no ownership of the data. That is strictly owned by the grower. Uh, there are a lot of data security issues that, that you know, we, we see and hear about all the time. And so what we have made a conscious decision to do is when a grower uh, you know, works with Ag Leader, that's their data. You know, we don't use it for any type of marketing. We don't have access to it and we, we kind of think that's a, a, a good thing. This is only my second time at being uh, involved directly with the show. Uh, I was there, here last year as well. And what I've noticed is the growers here are very serious. They have made an investment to be here. 
so they aren't just here to pick up pins. Uh, everybody that's been by the booth has had good questions. Um, it's amazing the, the varied amount of questions, everything from water management to data management to, to monitoring questions. Um, and they're very serious about it. And they're, they're all here to learn. I mean, every one of these sessions that have been going on, it's, it gets to be a ghost town out here. They take this learning and education very seriously. And for us to be able to be a part of that's important. Also, a lot of the same reasons. These guys are very passionate about this stuff. Uh, obviously, land stewardship is important to these guys. Uh, being able to, to take this land and move it on to the next generation. You know, growing up and being involved uh, on the farm at home, I know that really the ground is, is the lifeblood of the, of the family farm. Uh, people that aren't involved in agriculture don't see that. They don't, they don't know that. But to, to be involved with this, uh, with guys that are passionate about conserving the land and, and but yet making it profitable, uh, you know, that's that's important.